lot of the people in the comments section expressed frustration with learning this and I gotta admit it was not very easy but I'm gonna present it to you in a easier way and explain a little bit about uh, why this line works. So the line is over a C7 chord or you could play it over G minor either one goes like this let's break it down into smaller pieces learn each part so you really can remember the notes and then go on to the next part and then string them together it helps me to not pick every single note but to, to do some hammer-ons and pull-offs it actually helps the feel of it the first part of it goes like this root third fifth flat seven nine eleven chromatic approach to the third the second part goes like this basically doing enclosures around these notes. This note, this note, and then an approach to this note. Third part goes like this. Chromatic. So at speed, Putting everything together thus far we have. Now we've moved from this area, like over this chord, right, to this area. So over this area, the notes to keep an eye on here are this. So that's the third, fifth, seven, nine, 11, okay? The fourth part goes like this. Slow. So the last part goes like this. So from the beginning, thanks and have a good one.